Hello guys and welcome back to another college week in my life vlog. I'm very excited to take you guys along for this week. Um, I don't have too many plans, uh, lots of homework to catch up on and then I will be continuing part two of the unboxing that I started in last week's vlog. I also have another giveaway so stay tuned for that. If you like these videos be sure to give it a thumbs up, it really helps me out. Also if you're not already be sure to subscribe down below. Let me know if you guys are liking these college vlog videos or if you prefer a different style video um, I love making these but if you guys want to see another type of video I'm super open to whatever suggestions you guys have but yeah this morning I walked over to the UCLA campus like bookstore I had a few things I need to pick up and it was just so nice to walk onto campus even though I live like right next to campus um it's been a while since i've actually like walked over so it was really nice the sun was out and there's been like more people walking around campus you know with things opening up more and it's just so encouraging and it just makes me happy to see that it's more lively now so yeah i went over and picked that up and now i have some homework i'm gonna work on Okay, so I'm working on my notes for my accounting homework. I'm taking Management 1B, which is Principles of Accounting. I took Management 1A last spring, so this is like the next one in the sequence. After 14, page six. All right, I'm gonna solve this one two ways. I'm gonna solve it the way that we did on the previous page, which is to say, we're looking for the ending. I just finished all the notes and I'm gonna get started on the homework. This will be this week's homework. Um, we're on chapter 14, so that's all the notes I just did. And then these are just the uh, like homework problems. These are the numbers that correspond to the textbook for what homework problem we do. So this is a textbook. Um, something that you'll learn in college is that a lot of the textbooks, if you don't want to pay for the expensive hardcover, they will give it to you in this like loose leaf version. So I just go out and get a binder and put all of this loose leaf paper inside. Um, right now the binder is labeled Management 1A because we use the same textbook in our 1A class as our 1B and I never switched out and whatever. Anyways, so um, I gotta go to chapter 14. So as you can see, so questions at 14, number two through six. And then I head over to chapter 14. So yep, question set 14, two, and then three, four, five, six. So that's like the first chunk of the homework. So I'm gonna work on this um, and I'll do a little time lapse of myself. Also, fun fact about me, actually two fun facts about me. One, um, I live my life in darkness, I guess. I don't really like to turn on all the lights. Um, I guess it's a good thing because I save power. Um, so yeah, if you see all these shadows, that's because I only have like one light on over back there and all the rest of my lights are off. I don't know, I just, I just like to do my homework in darkness, I guess. Second fun fact about me is that I only use pens to do like all my work. I don't ever use pencils unless it's like a standardized test and I'm required to. So all my school supplies just consist of pens, specifically these erasable pens. Um, these are the Frixion erasable ballpoint pens and I have so many of these because these are the only pens I use. Erasable pens, specifically this brand, are they're the best. I just hate using pencils. I just love how pens glide. And then the thing with erasable pens is like, your girl makes mistakes, so I need an eraser. I just get these off Amazon and I have them in a ton of different colors. Okay, back to homework. Okay, I just finished the first part and I only got one question wrong, so I would say I would say that's pretty good. I'm feeling pretty good with this material, but I'm gonna make sure I do the rest of the homework, so let's work on that. Okay, I just took a little break and I went to the mailroom and I got sent a package from the brand T-I-J-N. Um, they reached out to me, they're like a blue light glasses, sunglasses, 
glasses company um, and they sent over a couple pair of glasses Ooh, oh wow okay it comes in two of these fancy cases i've been wanting to get blue light glasses for so long um i have a pair already but they are a little big for me so hopefully these fit i spend so much time on my computer and on my phone i mean i bet we all do like with online classes oh yeah these fit really well <laughs> obviously you can see like the light reflection um that ain't it but the glasses themselves um they're really lightweight which i appreciate and then they also let me choose out a pair of sunglasses so i got these like aviator kind oh wait i didn't even realize i picked out like a pink frame i thought i picked out a rose gold frame but whatever this is what they look like i really like the shape of these but yeah i live in california so like can never have too many sunglasses am i right again these are from tijn and i'll link their website down below hey guys so i'm on a walk right now this is your daily reminder to get some fresh air get some sunshine um because i have been working on homework all day this is just so needed like uh, I just feel so much better. I'm not gonna lie, last night, I don't know what hit me. Like, I just kind of had a rough night. Like, I haven't cried in a while, and I don't know what it is. Like, like there wasn't anything in particular that, like, triggered me or anything. But, I don't know, I was just kind of sad last night. So, today, I'm having a much better day. My mood is up. The sun is out. You know, like, things are, things are looking up. Also, can we just talk about like how beautiful that is? I'm like hiking um, near like Bel Air, so that's like the Bel Air Country Club. It's times like these that I am so glad that I live in LA where I can just step outside and get some vitamin D because after living in Seattle for 18 years, I can tell you seasonal depression is a thing. Uh, would you look at that beauty? This avocado went to private school. She rich, rich. I just finished another chapter for my management class. So now on to chapter 16's homework. Process costing and analysis. I'm just gonna write down all of these on my notebook so that I don't have to keep looking at this page. Okay, welcome back to part two of the mega unboxing. If you missed part one, it was my last college in my week, college life in my, college week in my life vlog. And also, like the last video, I will also be doing a giveaway where I give away a couple of these products. So stay tuned for that and stay tuned to see how you can enter the giveaway. And if you didn't enter the last giveaway in the last video, head on over to that video after this one. I will link that video down below. But on to part two. Victoria's Secret Pink sent over this giant, giant bag of clothes. They actually asked me to film a video for their YouTube channel where they wanted me to recreate different looks from their Instagram page. So in order to do that, they were like, oh, send over like some screenshots of pictures that you want to recreate from their VS Pink page. And then they sent over the pieces of clothing to recreate those photos. So they're super sweet and they sent over a ton of pieces. I believe by the time that this vlog is up, that YouTube video should be up. So I will link it down below. So let's get on into the unboxing. I'll also insert the pictures of me recreating the looks so you can kind of see what the pieces look like. The first one is they sent over this sweat set. It is in this, what is this animal? Zebra print. So it comes with this sweatshirt and then these sweatpants. Another sweat set. This is like a tan beige sort of color. So again, the sweatshirt and then the jogger sweatpants. And to go with that, 
They also sent over a couple pairs of their dad shorts. So this is what they look like. They're a little bit longer than regular shorts, which I really like. Um, they're perfect for like lounging around in. I love sleeping in these. And they're super sweet to actually send two of the exact same pair. Um, the only difference is one of them is in a size extra small and then the other is in a size small. So I think they just want to like send over two sizes in case one of them didn't fit. That's super sweet. They like got me covered. Thank you, Pink. <laughs> and then you guessed it, another sweat set. This one is a gray sweatshirt. And then instead of sweatpants, they sent over these shorts. They're a little bit shorter than the dad shorts, but these are really cute because they have like pockets on the side. Again, they're super sweet. And they sent over two sizes, a small and then extra small. And they actually also sent the dad shorts version of that gray color these biker shorts these are really cute they have like a mesh kind of panel on it okay this one i love this color this is their long sleeve tee um and then the back can you guys see that it says love pink and then lastly in that package they sent over these flare wide leg yoga pants guys do you remember when in middle school the whole flare wide leg yoga pants thing was a huge trend? I swear, every single girl at my middle school wore these yoga pants. Little did I ever think that these would come back in style, but now it's recircled. Like I've seen all those influencers and Instagram baddies wearing yoga pants. All right, that is it for this big package. Um, Thank you so much, Pink. Next package, they sent over this sweatshirt, very fun print a couple of their biker shorts this purple ombre one and then this black one with this like rainbow stripe down the side some scrunchies some more scrunchies and then a few of their new body care products this is one of their new scents sunset sorbet they sent the exfoliating body polish the body mist and then the body lotion this scent smells so good it's like a fruity berry kind of scent Next box. This is from the brand Ami. Sorry if I butchered that, but they were super sweet and they reached out to me. They sent over their makeup remover wipes, their cleanser, moisturizer, and then exfoliating body polish. I have yet to try this out, but I'm very excited to. So thank you so much, Ami, Amy. Next from Pink. This packaging, oh my gosh. When brands like focus on their packaging, I love it. It just elevates the whole unboxing experience. So it says seven days of pink. And when you open it up, ooh, it says Monday through Sunday, we've got you covered. Get excited, coming soon, a panty for every day. So as it says, it comes with a panty for every single day, Monday through Sunday. And then also I believe it actually says on it, like if I take these out, it says each day. That is so cute. Thank you so much, Pink. Next, another box from Pink. Ooh. Um, I'm so glad it's starting to get warmer out. I mean, I live in California. What am I saying? It's always warm. So I'm excited to start uh, like tanning out near the pool. They sent over a swimsuit. I don't know if I'd use this one in particular to go tanning. I'd use this one to go swimming, um, but I don't know about tanning because it has a very nice cutout right here and that would create an interesting tan line. Another box from Pink. As you can see, I get sent a ton of stuff from Pink, which I am so, so grateful for. Um, if you're wondering like, Maylee, why do you get sent so much stuff from Pink? It's actually because I'm a Pink Campus rep. I have a few videos explaining what the Pink Campus rep program is, but basically it's like a campus rep ambassador program for college students. They have the program at a lot of colleges. If you're a student, I highly recommend checking it out. I also have a whole video on my channel where I talk about the whole application process. So I will link that video down below. But yeah, one of the perks of being a campus this rep is they send a ton of packages with clothes and body care beauty products you put on events right now they're virtual events um, because we're in the panorama um, but yeah you put on events for students at your school and it's just a really great learning experience you learn a lot about marketing social media but in this next box oh my gosh i am obsessed with this print this is so trippy. Like, I love the colors. Just an oversized tee. Ow. My, like, legs are starting to cramp up. I might need to stretch after this. They also sent over this sweatshirt. They sent over these pair of dad shorts. And then also, I'm really excited to try this out. This is their Coco Chill Lotion. 
is their new calming body lotion with cannabis oil. I gotta say, Pink Beauty has been really popping off. They've been creating a lot of new products, so I will let you guys know what I think of this. Okay, we need a stretch. My legs are starting to hurt. A few moments later. Pink sent over two packages in these like envelopes. The first one, they sent over this phone wallet. So it's like one of those things you stick on the back of your phone and it holds all your cards, like your credit cards and stuff. It's from the brand Packed Party and it says made of stars. And then in the other one, they sent over this bralette. This is so cute and it also has like a hook closure. So you can make it into a racer back. I love this. It is so, so soft. It kind of reminds me of the Skims material. And then it also comes in the neutral color, which also reminds me of Skims. Okay, let's do the giveaway product. So the brand Nail Addict sent over some of their gel polishes. Let's open her up. Oh, wrong way. They sent over six other gel polishes and they also sent over this mini UV LED lamp. So one lucky winner will be winning this entire set so that you can give yourself a manicure and pedicure with all your new colors. In order to enter, head over to this TikTok video. I will also link it down below. Um, it explains all the giveaway rules. All you gotta do is basically like that video, follow me on TikTok, and then tag a friend in the comments. But yeah, as I said, all the rules are in that video. Um, so yeah, good luck and hope you guys win. Okay, let's make this one the last unboxing for this video. And then I'll film the part three for the next vlog. This one is also from Pink. Oh my gosh, okay. I am starstruck every time I open this box. They sent over this duffel bag. This is so sweet of them. It's so cute. In that box, they also sent over two sports bras. This is the first one. And then this is the second one, another black one. And then also super fun, they partnered up with the brand Clean Canteen to make this pink water bottle. This is so, so cute. I'm excited to use this. Okay, I'm gonna end part two here and then I'll pick up on part three of the unboxing, hopefully the finale of the unboxing in the next vlog. I'm gonna end the vlog here. Thank you guys for following along for this college week in my life. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. It really helps me out and be sure to subscribe down below. Let me know if you guys are liking these college vlogs and I'll definitely make more and I'll see you guys later. Bye.